Greetings viewers, Corporal Iron John here reporting from the front lines with your second factory, Communicate. Reports have shown that the battles at the city outskirts, a brand new 3 vs 3 map, have been ongoing since its release. Furthermore, commanders and soldiers alike are saying, and I quote, it's fun. Making war fun is no easy task, let me tell you that. So whether you enjoy capturing victory points or fighting in diverse areas like the woods or the industrial area, you are more than welcome to volunteer and sign up to fight in this sprawling metropolis. Moving on, to support commanders in their war efforts, a ping system has been made available to allow you to communicate to your allies. Suggesting to attack, defend, retreat, or letting your allies know you are on the way will establish a more intense and tactical gameplay because we all know communication, OP. Also, you can now get XP in multiplayer games. With those latest updates out of the way, here is the newest addition to the challenge maps. The Great War may have ended abruptly, but many decisive battles were fought in these long, grueling years. One of those battles was for this Saxonian-controlled garrison, an imposing stronghold built over the western border of Polania. The fortification had withstood Polanian assault twice already, but a new plan and an all-out attack could break the stalemate and force Saxony to concede the territory they gained. Besides the new challenge map, there are also some changes applied to Iron Harvest that we need to talk about. For example, numerous fixes to UI elements in various menus and the result screen to aid for clarity, fixed coin counts not updating after claiming a season tree node, move the ping button on the tactical map a bit down to prevent overlapping on the map graphic, and fixed issues with Halloween conditions for skirmish player number 2. This week does not come with any balance changes as we are now evaluating how to best implement your suggestions and what technical requirements it may entail, so stay tuned for more. Happy Halloween! The new Halloween themed cosmetics are available in the season tree of Iron Harvest so make sure to stop by before November the 16th to try and claim these rewards but also there is a spooky little surprise waiting for you all in the cemetery of the oil spill map. That is all I have for you today, so make sure to follow Iron Harvest and all the social media links down below. I am Corporal Iron John, and I'm signing out. Have a good one.